I didn't grow up religious. Uh, we went to church a couple of times, but we were asked to leave because my sister kept beating people up at Sunday school. Uh, and I think it would have been really easy uh, for someone to write a book where the religious people were bad because of big, spooky, capital R religion. And I didn't want to do a story about that. Um, I wanted to do something from the perspective of a kid who is just seeing someone unusual come into their life. So by having it be about Patrick, I can have that slightly snide teenage attitude of, hey, that thing you're doing is dumb, while also really closely examining why so many of the things happening in Patrick's life are dumb to try and find balance. Because where Patrick and Oscar find this, uh, this connection with each other is the same place that, Pat that Oscar is finding a connection to his mother. Why at the end of the story, Oscar has to say that, like, I love you, but I can't be a part of this anymore. And why, even though from the jump, Oscar says he's not sure if he believes in God, he is still sticking to the ideal, sticking to the behaviors, sticking to the, the routine of it, because it's where he feels a sense of community.